Please now welcome Sheikh Yusuf Estes and the newly converted Muslims. Takbir! Takbir! Bismillah. Assalamu alaikum. Alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Hu Allah di jawa na muslimina. Wa salatu wa salamu ala rasul al kareem. Let me hear you do it one more time. Assalamu alaikum. Allahu akbar. Alhamdulillah rabbil alameen. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he is the one who gives hidayah. He's the one who guides the people. He guided me, alhamdulillah, 14, 15 years ago, alhamdulillah. He guided my wife, he guided my father, he guides everybody who's guided. Today, alhamdulillah, we have some more people ready to do the shahada, enter Islam with us. What we want to do is, that, first of all, I'll let you know, we've already talked to them, and they've actually expressed their belief behind the stage, so that we know for sure that they know what they're getting into. Because after all, if you're going to be a Muslim, you've got to know what it's all about. And what we did, we explained it to them, and we're going to do it again. And the sisters are here to help them. We're going to say it in English first, and then we're going to say it in Texas Arabic. Inshallah. And I'll start with Rosalind first, and just repeat after me. I bear witness. I bear witness. There's no God to worship. There's no God to worship. Except Allah. Except Allah. And I bear witness. And I bear witness. Muhammad is his messenger. Muhammad is his messenger. Takbir! Now, Takbir! And, and now I'm going to ask our new sister, tell me your name. Charlene. Charlene. Um, okay. Shh. I want to ask her to repeat this in English. I bear witness. I bear witness. There is no God to worship. No God to worship. Except Allah. Except Allah. And I bear witness. I bear witness. Muhammad. Muhammad. Is his messenger. Is his messenger. MashaAllah. Takbir! Takbir! Now what I want you to do, everybody get up. Get up off your feet. Get up. Stand up. On your feet. Yeah, not... Not off your feet, on your feet, yeah. Get off your seat. <laughs> Everybody up. All of us together, we're going to help them do the shahada. This way we're going to ask Allah to give some reward to all of us. Ashadu. 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 An la ilaha. An la ilaha. Illallah. Illallah. Wa ashadu Wa ashadu Anna Muhammad Anna Muhammad Rasulullah Rasulullah Now say it Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar For the next 60 seconds I'm going to try to explain a simple point to all of us and for our new sisters as well. When anybody accepts Islam, Allah forgives all of their previous sins since they were born. He turns their speedometer back to zero. And then He replaces all of their deeds with good deeds. Mountains of good deeds, no bad deeds. Back again like a newborn baby as a virgin starting all over in the life. And this is the Rahmah of Allah. But there's more. Allah accepts their dua immediately. Immediately. Because they are pure and they're close to Allah. So we're going to ask them now as their first act as Muslims to make dua for us and for the Ummah of Muhammad Wasallam that Allah give us the success. So ladies, we just want you to, if you would please, Come to one second. If you got anything you'd like to say to us or make dua for us, please. If you want to say a few words as well. Go ahead. You get the microphone. Yes. 
If you want to, up to you. Or you can just make a prayer for us, up to you. I pray for each and every one of you, and I've been studying Islam for 17 months, and this is a really happy day, and I pray for all your sins to be forgiven, and for Allah to be merciful to everyone here. Amen. 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 Give her the microphone. Give her the microphone. Thank you so much, and I pray our Lord bless you and keep you all in good health and a good spirit, and enjoy the afternoon. So I just want to say thank you very much. God bless you and keep you. Allahu Akbar! Allahu Akbar! Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. I'm Sister Patricia. I'm from Germany, and I came all the way here with my friend Marlies, who is standing there and my two daughters first i would like to thank allah for making it possible for us it's a dream come true and for everyone who was involved just to make this happen i have one thing to say to those new muslims and to everyone here before i became a muslim you think of like dark men with their beards these are the muslims they're criminals they are rough they're rude and the women oh poor women they are so oppressed and they are so beautiful why do they cover up and subhanallah, the strongest men, the strongest men I ever saw are the Muslim men. And at the same time, I haven't seen any eyes much more filled with tears than the eyes of a Muslim man when the name of Allah is mentioned. And I haven't seen any woman more beautiful on this earth than a Muslim woman and another woman more beautiful and more respected in Islam than the Muslim woman is. And being a Muslim is the best that ever happened to me in my entire life. And I hope they will experience the same. Allahu Akbar.